Uh, today, I'm going to take you on a tour of three new construction homes out in Lutz, Florida. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Josh Bryan, and I'm your Tampa Bay area real estate expert. So enough talking, let's begin this tour. All right, so today we are out in Lutz, Florida in a new uh, community. These are uh, Mad Me homes and just panning around. There are gonna be homes here and like single family homes and actually townhomes as well. As you can see, they're still building. And these are all the model homes that I'm gonna go through today. Uh, first one's gonna be a four bedroom, two and a half bath, three car garage, 2713 square feet, as you can see here. So let's go take a look at this. All right, so when you first come up, you got your seating area here. And full disclosure, I have not been inside this yet. So you will get to see it the same time I get to see it. All right, so when you first come in to the left, there is a flex room here, um, obviously set up as an office. All right, so let's just do downstairs first and then we'll go upstairs. All right, so to the right, you're going to have the garage. And this one's gonna be a three car tandem. And I'm hoping that sign was correct because this is not really a three car. Um, there's no way to get three cars in here. Unless one of them is a golf cart, which is not a car. All right, so you're gonna have a half bath right here. Come in, nice kitchen, just pan around. This one has a pool, so I'm gonna have to ask them if they're actually doing pools with their builds because most of the builders here are not, that is not an option right now. Nice walk-in pantry. Oh yeah, wow. And of course you got some understair storage that goes into with, be nice to have a light back here, huh? It keeps going. So you got a lot of, you know, a lot of storage back here. Um, it would be nice, like I said, if they had a light back there, but a lot of storage. It's a nice hood and sink in the island, dishwasher in the island, double oven, microwave. All right, so let's go over here. And I don't have, like, he didn't give me any of the, uh, like, the floor plans and stuff, so I don't have those in front of me to kind of lay out so I'm assuming this is going to be well just it's on little on suite I guess it could be a first floor master if you want to we'll find out when we go upstairs but there's a shower here a little bit smaller bathroom, so I, this is probably not the master. But you're gonna have, I mean, these are these are awesome. You got your slide glass doors um, on both sides. Obviously, on right here, they're going to collapse on each other. So you can open all this up. Like I said, I'll have to find out uh, if they're doing pools or not with the new builds, and I can let you know. Um, and this is, you know, you know, tipper glass and the fence. This is the way to do it if you're gonna, you know, do a pool fence like kids, pets, whatever, um, versus those just like black mesh kind of things. I mean, this is this is nice. I mean, they need to. Do some weeding on the uh, the pool deck, but this is nice. 
And you get your pond view here. All right, so let's go back inside and go upstairs and take a look. This is pretty nice so far. I right, got the wood for the stairs. To the right, you got a nice loft. Let's see, and this is gonna face the front, but obviously you can choose your lot. All right, let's go. This is gonna be the master, let's go right here. All right, so we first come in, you got your bathroom. Nice shower, soaker tub. to the master oh they got motion i did not turn the fan on my own the light came on and the fan came on with motion detector oh so you got the tray ceiling here that's a pretty cool fan stainless steel fan and then this particular property you're you know looking out over the the pond and your pool And let's go in this walk-in closet. Let's see if this one automatically turns on. Well, there's a light on, but it's probably those lights that warm up and take a little bit of time because it's not very bright in there. All right, let's continue. All right, so right here, you're gonna have a linen closet. It's gonna be your mechanical or your AC unit anyway. And then you have a second floor laundry. So that's nice. All right, back out. There's gonna be three more bedrooms. And then you have a bathroom here, nice tall sinks. And can lighting in here instead of uh, there's just fixtures on the wall. And then bedroom number four. All right, so that's gonna be this property. Let's head over next door to the next model. All right, so next door, the next property is the Amelia model. Three bedroom plus a flex room, two bath, two car garage, 1735 square feet. So let's go inside and take a look. I like how they do the uh, the pavers for the driveway instead of the, the concrete. So, you know, Mad Me builds a good home, or at least. All right, so first, just like the last one, first you come in. And to the left, you have your flex room set up as an office. You have the can lights. And then you come in 
to you know, wide open you know, kitchen and living room. And this is gonna be a single story. So you got your electric appliances. Need a smoke detector battery somewhere. All right, so let's go take a look and see what is behind. This mystery door is your coat closet or linen closet. Actually, this might be, this is actually gonna be your pantry. And then right here, you're gonna have your laundry room. And a closet here with your AC unit. And then out here is going to be your two car garage. Let me see if I can find the light. All right, here we go. All right, so this one is a two car garage. You know, the last one was bigger, but like I said, I don't think there's any way to get three cars in that last one. So let's continue on. We'll go right here. You're gonna have your bathroom here. Just a single vanity. And then your linen closet. It's nice that they're actual doors and not you know, the bifolds. Nice size ceilings. You have, you know, crown molding all around. All right, so we're gonna have bedroom number two right here. And that's your neighbor's pool. Let's go take a look at this one. This bedroom's kind of small, but it's only what 1700 and you know, something square feet, so it's not the biggest. All right, let's continue on, and your master's gonna be back here. A decent size. Ah, this is the smoke detector that needs battery replacement. They got some cool fans. I'll get, give them that. I mean, the whole place is looks nice, but all right. So nice size walk-in closet. And master bath. And I will get the pricing on these models and I'll link it below in the comments for each model. So you'll know, you know what these are going for. All right, and then no need to go outside. You can see right here. This one obviously is, you know, screened back patio. Um, you know, the good thing is it's got a ceiling fan. Bad thing is with this wall here, you don't get as much breeze, you know, flowing through. But it is what it is. All right, so let's head over to the next one. All right, so the next one is the single story Elm model. It is a four bedroom plus a home office, three bed, two bath. I'm sorry, four bed, three bath, two car garage, 2344 square feet. So let's go inside and take a look at this one. All right, so when you come in right to the left, you're going to have 
bedroom up front here. Nice tall ceilings. And then a bathroom right here. So this could be you know, good for, you have guests. They can just kind of stay at the front of the house and have access to their own bathroom. And then right here you have your linen closet. Okay, all right, so let's go right. And then this is gonna be, garage door. there you go, your garage. So two car garage, water heater out here. This is probably going to be a C. And then your laundry. Not sure if there's an option to have water here if you want her to sink, but nice to have the counter. All right, so your office here. All right, so come in and so this is nice and open. Have your dining room here, living room there, kitchen here. Nice big island. All right, let's head on over here. It's gonna be two bedrooms right here. So let's just go in this way. Closet, nice size, nice size closet. And then you gotta have a bathroom here. Obviously, there will be a door here, but right now there is no door. And linen closet. Bedroom number three or four, however you want to count it. And then we'll hit the master in the back of the house. All right, so the master is going to be here. Nice size closet. That nice pond view right out the backyard. Nice big shower. All right, so get your double vanity. And then your nice walk in shower with dual shower heads. So that's nice. And then you got your, you know, transom window up top, let some light in. And then toilet here and some shelves. All right, let's go back around here. I think we got pantry left right here. Nice, nice size pantry. And then let's come over here to the living room. 
and I believe this is a little bit bigger patio. Might be about the same size, but it just looks a little bigger. All right, so that's gonna do it for this tour. Let me know in the comments below, what'd you think? Which of the three models was your favorite? If you're thinking about making a move, reach out. Whether you're looking for new construction or a resale, I'm here to be a resource for you. My contact information will be in the description below. So feel free to give me a call, send me a text, shoot me an email, whatever, whatever is uh, most convenient for you. Until the next video, take care.